Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I'm Chelsea if you're new and welcome back to moving vlog number four. We're getting somewhere. Things are definitely going to happen in this vlog. Y'all see me start off. This is the first time I use my Nespresso and this coffee is so good y'all. It is so good. In a cup, this coffee tumbler mug, whatever you want to call it, comes from Amazon. I'll have a link down below. But the actual coffee is just so good. So I did um, a double espresso pod. So I did the pod and then I put almond milk in there and then I put a little bit of my caramel macchiato Starbucks creamer. Chef's kiss. It is so good. It, it, it was kind of hard to mix up to get all the flavors mixed together. So what I did was take like a plastic cup and just dump it back and forth. It's so good, y'all. Like it is so good. And then y'all see me also use my toaster and make me a bagel. This is a blueberry bagel with strawberry cream cheese. Too good. But in moving vlog number three, I talked about how I did not like the way the Nespresso looked on the counter, and I still don't. A lot of you all were concerned. Basically, just saying like taking it back and forth every day is a lot i just want to say i don't drink coffee every day and if it is a morning where i'm drinking coffee nine times out of ten is a slow morning for me because to be able to get up and make the coffee that means i'm not in a rush to do anything so i personally don't mind the back and forth because it's not like i'm going to be using it every day so yeah i don't i don't mind it because i just really don't like it on the counter like it just it's not giving what I thought it would give. And then some of y'all was seeing that space right there, like the little nook that we was talking about in moving vlog number three where we put the picture at. Y'all was talking about um, making that like a coffee nook. And I just, I, I don't need a whole dedicated coffee area. I just don't, you know, I just, I just really don't. So the coffee machine will be back in the pantry um, and when I want to use it, I'll just bring it out, like no big deal. As I live here, things might change. I might want it on the counter. Maybe when it gets cold outside, I might figure out something to do with it then. But as for now, I don't want it on the counter and that's completely fine. So we're gonna start off this vlog going to Ikea. By the end of this vlog, I will have my bed from my apartment over to the townhouse and we will probably begin living here by the end of this vlog so that's kind of exciting but i'm going to ikea today because i seen two different mirrors that i really liked for on top of the nightstands i seen like this oval one and then i seen like these long um like rectangular shaped ones and i just want to see them in person to see which one looks better because i do want to get some today so whether it's the oval or the rectangle will decide i also want to go to cb2 i don't know if that's going to happen because the way this townhouse is set up it has this chandelier hanging down which is not my favorite thing in the world i actually wish it was not there but um it has this chandelier hanging down so i have to put a dining table in here which i'm kind of excited to have a dining room table i just wish that Maybe the chandelier was a little bit over some. Let me, let me show y'all. This is the chandelier in question. So the table would obviously have to go right here, which leaves all this open space. And then there's the kitchen. I just wish the chandelier was a little bit more over because the chandelier is right here. And then this is the living room. So I just wish it was over some. But it is what it is. I seen this table at um, CB2 and it is on back order. So if I wanna get it, I wanna go ahead and order it now. But yeah, I think it'll be cute. Hopefully, we'll see. Y'all are gonna dead. I'm gonna switch the battery and I'll be back. Made it to Ikea. Um, I'll see you guys in. On our way. If you've ever been to Ikea, then you know like how aggravating their carts are. They have the worst carts in the history of carts. Ugh. How do y'all feel about these chairs? I think those would be cute for outside and you don't have to worry about them like getting messed up from the weather and stuff. Those are kind of cute. I'm gonna take a picture. I'll take one of these just for the hell of it. 
<laughs> I kind of like this dining room table. I just feel like it's so big. But I love the, the black legs with the wood. I think it's cute. Y'all, this table for the rooftop, I think, oh, it, look at the, I like the bench. This is cool and I like how it's all one, just one thing. I used to have some, but they were separate. I think that's cool. Just put everything where it need to go. Hey y'all. Huh. So let me show y'all the mirror that I came to look at. It is down here. This one right here, over the nightstands. These, I think that'd be cute. It was another one that I was looking at too, but I don't see it. So I think I'm probably gonna just go with this one because I really like this. Do I need this? No. Am I getting this? Yes. I will not give into my temptation of buying glasses. There's nothing I need, but this one is kind of cute. I don't know y'all, the price of pillows is kind of scary because $45? Um, okay, the price of trash cans, I just, I don't understand. This vase is cute, but I think I can do a smaller one like this one. Or even one like this. I think I'm gonna go with this one. Oh wait. I think they come in a set, a set of three. Ugh. I don't want all of these. That just pissed me off. This vase is really pretty. I like that. I want to get some big pillar candles, but I don't know if I want this like cream color or if I want white. I wonder if it's like a price difference. Finally found the mirror. I'm going to pick it up. Ugh, it's lit. It feels like a felon. Literally. I am in Byredo. Y'all know I have this in my kitchen right now, but I don't have the hand soap, so I'm just picking up the hand soap for the kitchen. It's super cute in here, y'all. Super cute. I'm also going to pick up a hand cream. Y'all know Mojave Ghost is my favorite. Huh? Walker. Thank you. Thank you. Having like a late lunch at this place called Vito's Tacos. I'm excited to see what it's giving. And I also got Diria. I'm excited, I'm so hungry y'all. Hey y'all, what is up? It has been a few days since I've been on this vlog, but I'm back um, to kind of give y'all a haul of the Ikea stuff and the H&M stuff from moving vlog number three has come in and I want to show y'all. So we're just gonna do some unboxings real quick, but y'all know first, I got the suede lotion for the kitchen. We'll set that up in a second. Other thing I ordered from Amazon was these like numbers for our um, trash cans. I realized everybody kind of had like stickers on their trash can with the address on it so nobody won't steal your trash can. So ordered some of these off Amazon. I thought I ordered the white ones, but these are silver, but they'll get the job done. We just need to put the um, address on there. What else, what else, what else, what else? As far as when I went to Ikea, y'all know I really just went for the mirrors, which by the end of this vlog, they'll be put up. Y'all will see them. I didn't bring them tonight with me, but y'all seen them. I got a bunch of freaking white pillar candles. I don't know why. I just love the way they had them displayed, so I picked up a bunch of them. Picked up this strainer. Thought it was really, really cute. And the last two things I got from Ikea were super random, but they're just these like exfoliating tools. Like this is a, uh, I don't know what it's called, but it looks like this. You put one hand right here, the other hand right here, and you just go on your back and scrub your back. 
And then this one is just. And then this one is just like an exfoliating hand mitt. So that's what I got from Ikea. This is another Amazon package. I'm pretty sure this is my phone holder for my shower. Because I love watching YouTube in the shower. Or being on FaceTime with my friends. Or just whatever. You know. While I'm in the shower. So my last shower phone holder broke. And it was freaking blue. So I wanted to get another one anyways. This one. I don't like when I be having to put stuff together. Like it could all be so simple. It's up to here. Okay, perfect. So this goes on the shower wall and then this is what your phone will look like on it. Well, let me put my phone on so y'all can see it. So this is basically what it looks like. Like this. My phone feels pretty sturdy. And then yeah. So I'm excited to try that out. Clear the trash. And then the last thing I have to show y'all is the H&M stuff. If you did not see the moving vlog number three, definitely check it out before we move forward. But I ordered some bathroom stuff. I don't know which bathroom. At first, I was thinking it was going to be the bathroom I'm going to be using the most. But now, I kind of feel like I want to put it in the bathroom that's in the master bedroom. I don't know, but let me show y'all. All right, so these are the rugs. They feel pretty good. I ordered two of these rugs. They're just like black rugs. Ooh, and they have this like non-slipness to them on the bottom. So I ordered two of those. This is... Oh, it's so pretty, y'all. So pretty. This is the soap dispenser. This is the toothbrush holder. Y'all, this... Oh, I love it. So pretty. And this is the soap tray, but I'll probably use it to like put my rings and jewelry on. And the last thing is this laundry basket. Ooh, it's big. I like it. I like it. Picasso. Ooh, it's really big, y'all. Let's add some shape to it. This is what it looks like. It's really big. You gotta get some structure to it, but I really like those items. I'm happy. Let's go ahead and add the soap. I mean the lotion. So that's how it looks. Super cute. And as of right now today, that's all I have for y'all because I am going out of town tomorrow. However, this vlog will pick up as soon as I get back. So while I'm out of town, Dion is going to get a U-Haul truck and he's going to bring the bed over here. Um, the deep freezer over here. And just the big stuff over here. So when we get back, our bed is going to be here and we can like start like decorating a room. It's going to be super exciting. I'm super excited. So yeah, I will see y'all in about a week. It's not going to be a week to y'all. It's only going to be a second. But to me, it will be July and it will be a week. So I will see y'all. Your girl.
me. I'm back. <laughs> that was weird. Um, I'm back. Vacation was cool. Had a great time. Woo, 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 woo. Now we're back to this moving vlog. Like I told y'all, Dion was going to move the big things. So we have our bed in here. Um, child, listen. This was supposed to be our sheet last night. This was supposed to be our sheet last night. Barely worked. Um, these lamps I got yesterday from Home Goods, and I'm debating on whether or not I like them. I'm gonna show y'all the lamps that I had already, but debating on whether or not I like them. I'm about to go ahead and wash the sheets, which are these Tahara brand linen sheets. Well, linen blend. I'm going to wash these so we can have something to sleep on tonight. Alright. Just going to wash everything up. I've never had linen sheets before. I've had a linen comforter. So I'm excited to see how this is going to feel on a body. I really like how this washing machine tell you how long it's going to take, so 47 minutes. I also really want to get this area situated, but it probably won't happen in this vlog because mainly in this vlog, we are getting the room situated. This right here is literally going to be the death of me. It looks so dirty. I don't know what happened. I don't know if it got hit in the move or what, but... We're going to try to get that clean too. Hey y'all, so I made it back to the old place. Um, I needed to pick up some packages. I wanted to get my steamer right here. Because I know them linen sheets are going to need to be steamed. And yeah, it's just a few things I needed to pick up. A few things I needed to do. But I'm getting ready to head out. I'm going to stop by Chick-fil-A because I am so hungry. I'm so hungry. So actually, let me place my little order right now so i can have it waiting for me at the zoo do i want to use 800 points for macaroni no i don't boom 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 complete my order boom, boom. apple pay double click processing and we are done. I also, after we go to Chick-fil-A, I think I wanna stop by CB2 because there's a dining table I'm considering. So I wanna look at that. And I need to take y'all back to the new place because I was like head over heels stuck on getting a sectional. But now that he put the other couch in the living room, I just don't know how I feel about a sectional. I need to figure out which direction I want to go in. But like I said, the main focus of this vlog is the bedroom. So, yeah. Just want to let y'all know what's going on. I'm hungry. I feel a little delulu. Your girl. Mm -mm 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 -mm. It's full. Whew. One thing about me. I'm going to eat my food in the car. I'm, I'm going to eat the food in the car. I enjoy eating my food in the car so much like i'm pulled over at the gas station i got my youtube video going i sit my dipping sauces up here i'm dipping i'm eating i'm watching i'm drinking the vibes are there okay i'm in a great mood now what i will say is i got macaroni because i was in the mood for macaroni um i think i told y'all this before sometimes i like it sometimes i don't i don't know if i like it this time because they didn't give me nothing to eat it with so that's that I also had got a peach. They got some type of peach drink. One thing about Georgia, they're going to have peach shit. Like, I'm from Florida. I think our fruit, well, I know our fruit is like orange, but we ain't going crazy with the orange stuff. Georgia peaches, they do everything with peaches. It's crazy. <sighs> At first, I wasn't going to hit the CB2 because I didn't feel like it, and I still kind of don't, but... Mm, I might. So I'm here at this place called the West Side Market. I had seen it a few times. 
Now I always said I wanted to come in here, so we're gonna see what they got. I love these lamps. They're so nice. There's this painting over here, right there. I like so much, y'all. So pretty. It's like $950. I might have to try to recreate this because this is so cute. All of these paintings are so nice. That's so pretty. Bro, are you fucking kidding me? I never started it. <sighs> Shut up. Oh, hold to start. I only pressed it. <sighs> I'm so freaking pissed. Baby, I done came with the fabric, um, the dryer sheets, and everything. Wow. Just put the sheets on the bed. I knew they would be wrinkled because they are linen. And uh, y'all see that? Those are blue stains from when I thought I started the washer, but I did not. So dealing with that, it's <laughs> some like down here too. And this part right here looks hollow because it is Mufasa ate the, well ripped up the mattress. Um, foam thing. I think I told you that a long time ago, but other than that, it looks pretty good. It looks like it's going to be very, very comfortable. I was going to steam it, but I don't feel like doing it no more because we're going to get ready to go to Home Goods. I mean, um, Home Depot. Hey y'all, so I'm at Target right now. I'm getting this um vacuum cleaner. The same one Brooke got, she be raving about it, saying how much she loves it, how good it is. And she says it's often on sale. I have been watching it for a little bit. It's originally like $200, then it went down to $169, and now it's $149. So I decided to go ahead and pick that up. I'm not gonna get too much out of Target because they're like daily deal whatever it's called thing starts tomorrow their target circle thing start, starts tomorrow so I want to see like what they're going to have on sale but I am about to pick up some of my um candles I like and dinner then I want hamburger helper so that's what we're going to get and just some other shit so yeah come on it's looking like none of the ones I like which is salt they have they have a lot of pompous <sighs> Which is okay, but I like salt. And all of these are different. And I don't want this container because I want to put them in like small spaces. I'm upset. Honestly, I'm a little annoyed that they sell nothing from Casaluna in black. Like I really want to do these black accents. I can't find anything black. Excuse me? Baja Blast? Yes, please. I've never seen this before. Y'all, it's the next morning. This vacuum is going back. Not because I don't love it. I honestly have not tried it yet. I told y'all the Target Circle stuff was starting today. I got this vacuum yesterday for $149 and now it's on sale for $129. So I'm taking this one back and I already got ordered the other one for pickup so yeah shut up we about to put the mirrors up y'all i don't know if it was this vlog or the last vlog i can't even remember but this is the mirrors from ikea hopefully they're not too big but i wanted something kind of big to go so we're gonna see so you going downstairs this what the mirror look like I don't know I just what I think my problem is as bad as I want these lamps because I really like the lamps the lamps don't match the nightstand uh, can you please go get the nightstand from downstairs what I, nightstand they in my room on the first floor I just want to see if them look better because this is just not the vibe. Like, it's. Put them together? No, it's the nightstands from the other place. It's just like these nightstands is giving boho and that's giving like 
something different. But I feel like the nightstand go good with the bed, which I really don't want the bed. But I just think the nights. I keep saying nightstand. The lamps. I don't know. The lamps. I feel like the lamps don't go. I want them to go, but they don't. I think I'm gonna have to keep the ones I got because I'm going for a more like dark boho feel and I just don't think the lamps match that <sighs> so we'll see in about two minutes all right so I think I like this one better I put it towards this end because I'm gonna decorate the nightstands but for now I do think it kind of look a little better in the middle since there's nothing else up there um yeah I think I'm gonna just sit with these nightstands because the nightstand I mean <sighs> The lamps match the night stands that I just think. Oh, I gotta see. Bless me. I just think I like this vibe better. And like I said, the night stands are gonna be decorated, so it's gonna look better than that. But yeah, I'ma choose these night stands over those. And I ain't mad because these is eighty dollars a piece, which means I get my money back. Everybody doing something but you. Hmm? You have no words? Alright. The other mirror is getting put up, y'all. I gotta find me a nice little situation for right there. But I definitely like these better. Like, it's just... It, I, I just like it once I decorate the nightstands. Look, one, two, three. Yeah. Okay. The mirrors... Damn, now that I turned the camera on, it look a little weird, but... Who's that dog? Who is that? <laughs> I like the mirrors, though. I'm happy, so... I'm excited to decorate the nightstands and just get... Get it popping, you know? Y'all wanna know what I just remembered? I bought a freaking hatch, and... We about to find it... And plug it up. Uh, y'all I can't do this right now because you need Wi-Fi to hook it up so not how do you turn this light off though I don't even know how I turned it on um how do you turn the light off so once we get the Wi-Fi which is supposed to be tomorrow hopefully tomorrow moving on to the shower I'm about to put a uh, shower caddy up because we have not been living right it's giving ghetto so i'm gonna put a shower caddy up so we can get our stuff off the floor and also y'all i want to switch this out Dion said he think he can do it so i'm gonna look for one i like order it and then we're gonna try to switch that out cute i like the way it looks yeah and the shower is so far away so you don't have to worry about it getting wet or anything like that. I might add one more for like, um, sorry y'all. Oops, sorry. I might add one more for like sugar scrubs because I don't want to overcrowd it, but I really like that vibe. That's cute. And the light in the bathroom is, I don't know what type of lights these are, but I like them. Let me show y'all this little light feature. So the, the lights came with this remote. It controlled the light and the speed of the fan but it also dims the lights come on now that's a lot <laughs> about to go to home goods and i'm also gonna go back to america signature furniture to look at that couch that i'm kind of considering but i'm gonna go to home goods first out of this whole store i found this little cup or glass which is so cute and then I found this lamp, which I thought was cute. Obviously, I got a thing for lamps right now, but yeah, that's what I found. So this is the couch, but it wouldn't. I wouldn't get that extra ottoman piece. I would just get those four pieces, like the L. So I'm debating, but I think I do like it. Although the reviews say I do like peel. I just feel like that's just something I'm going to have to deal with. No matter if it's this couch or another couch. So, we'll see. Made it to Home Depot. We are here to see about some blinds. The cost of 
fucking blinds are insane. But these one we're looking at just like, I would consider this just like a basic blind. They're expensive, child. Mm -mm. But we're about to get these and see if they work. This little console situation I've had for a long time now. I don't know if it's going to stay in here permanently. But for now, I am going to put it in here and decorate it. I just got to put the glass on the top. If y'all hear a lot of noise, Dion is putting the blinds up. So, yeah. That's that. on the top and then it's like a mirror glass that goes on the bottom I've heard this is like the best glass cleaner, so I'm going to go ahead and spray this and give it a good wipe. So it looks really, really good. It looks clean. That stuff does work really good. So yeah, get you some. And if you're interested in this like console situation, I got it probably like four or five years ago from Overstock, but I believe they still have it. I'm going to go downstairs and see what I got to decorate with because I don't think I've brung over um, decorations and stuff. So let me see what I got. The blinds in the kitchen are up and I'm so happy because now I can actually like vlog over here, which it's kind of dark without that, but we got lights. Okay, so yeah, like with the lights it's better. But now I can actually like, you know, like hold y'all up and be able to show y'all because before everything was just kind of like down. And then I just made this huge, gigantic mess putting the blinds up. So disregard, but. I like them. I'm, I'm happy with how they look and I just, it, it feels more homey now that we have some blinds. I've been using the kit lens. <sighs> I've been using the kit lens that come with this Canon M50 and it's just, I don't like it. <laughs> I just don't like it. I really, really do um, enjoy the Sigma lens, but I love the fact that this lens is able to zoom in and out, blah, 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 who cares? But it's the next day. It is July 11th. Um, 317, I'm just getting my, <laughs> y'all know, I've told y'all in my little, um, townhouse community, nobody really has blinds, but we getting blinds, but we have one right here. We just need to get two more. I was just completely naked, oblivious to the fact that people are out there 
and she was like on the phone going off I can see her and then she turned around and I think she saw me like naked and she was just like what the fuck like <sighs> but yeah that that's the girl I don't know if I told y'all but I be watching her watch YouTube all the time she got this big ass TV I don't know what room that is she's in but I'm thinking she works from home because she had like a big ass TV and then a big ass monitor that she be sitting down at. So, yeah, she be watching YouTube a lot. Oh, I wonder if she watched me. Hey, girl, watch me. Love you. Um. Anyways, I am about to head out. Um. I don't know what's going on with the Wi-Fi. They. My man calling me. Hold on. Hello. I'm about to go over there. I got to upload my video. All right. Where is it? Did you ever take it out the car? All right. Oh. But I was basically saying, I don't know what's going on with the Wi-Fi. There is something, a, a, a conduit or something each house is supposed to have just my fucking luck my house is the man that came yesterday said he don't know if it's stuck down deep or if they didn't put one i don't know but it has just been stressing me out because i can't live in a house house without wi-fi like i literally need wi-fi to do my job so i've been a little bit stressed about that i'm glad that when i was disconnecting things at the other place I just decided to keep everything on until the end of the month so I can still go over there, upload my video. So while I'm over there, we're going to pack some more stuff up, bring it over here. And yeah, like this has been the longest moving process I've ever been through in my life. But it is what it is. I'm enjoying each moment. I'm glad that I can document it and y'all can share these moments with me because it's definitely filled with highs and lows and I'm just happy that you know I have the memory so I'm dressed in my little lemon set you knew it <laughs> because I don't have no clothes y'all I swear to god I be wearing the same like four articles of clothing back to back recycling them because I just I ain't doing nothing I ain't going nowhere who cares you know so yeah let me Grab my laptop, grab my charger, and we're gonna head out. Y'all, the apartment. Is coming empty slowly but surely. <laughs> it looks a mess in here. Oh my god! What? <sighs> it's crazy. Look at this fucking room. Like, whew. how about as soon as I got into the apartment and I closed the door and locked the door, somebody knocked on the door and it was two girls and it was asking basically, like, um, do you live out here? It was just asking for my review because she's considering moving out here. And basically, I told her, like, if you don't have a problem with walking a half a mile to get to your apartment, you'll be okay. I think her biggest thing was safety. I did tell her my car get, did get bro broken into, like, once. I don't hold that against the apartments. I don't really have, like, a real problem with the apartments. It's just... The construction so if she don't have a problem with that then i think she'll be fine um yeah i'm watching you and i'm trying to export my video and while i'm doing that i'm about to clean out this refrigerator basically probably throw all this shit away so yeah you guys we met a neighbor it's the next day by the way we never met a neighbor i was sitting on like the balcony and sebastian was out there and i think he came out there because he wouldn't just like check sebastian out but Seem pretty cool. Um, so yeah, that's cool. We're about to go to Publix because I kind of want to cook tonight. I just want to cook some grilled cheese and chili. And then we're going to take Sebastian to the dog park because he ain't been in a minute. So yeah. You getting the ball? 
You don't want that one? Mm, I guess I'll get it. Come on, let's go up the stairs. Yeah, it's a lot of dogs out here, y'all. A lot. <laughs> Friday. I just finished doing some skincare. Girl, it is late in the day. Like, <clears throat> it is late in the day. I should have been dead. My hygiene stuff, but I've been chilling. It's 3.41. I was like, let me get up and do something. So, I washed my face. I brushed my teeth. I oiled my scalp because, girl, mm, as much as I love braids, I don't know how now to pull my hair so tight. Like, I love tight ponytails. I'm not one to just put my hair in a loose ponytail. I want to pull my shit so tight. And as you can see, girl, I got a little ball spots on the side. So, I oiled my scalp up, um, did my hygiene, did all the things. And now I'm just chilling. I just wanted to let y'all know I'm up. <laughs> I'm Adam. I don't know what I'm going to do today. I want to end this vlog today because it's been going on for so long. It's like I'll vlog like two minutes each day and then put the camera down. But I'm about to make my bed, get situated because I want to show y'all what we got going on in the room so far. I plan for the room to be done in this vlog, which was very, very, very unrealistic of me. But sometimes I'll be doing that the room is not going to be done I L I do have progress though there is progress it's not going to be done though so I'll show y'all what I have so far and then yeah that's that so I'll be back I will be back these are all of the curtains that was up in my apartment whether they were in my room or in the living room it's so many of them and as you can see they giving crusty, dusty, disgusting. I don't like it. I'm going to try to wash them to see how white I can get them. Because if they don't come white, I'm going to have to get some more. And these curtains was expensive. This is probably like $500 worth of curtains right here. So, hopefully, they come clean. Because I, I, I don't like the way this look. Period. <laughs>
All right, we got that going. Let's close up the laundry area. Hopefully, like I said, those come clean. Save your girl some money. Also, y'all, I started decorating this thing with stuff I already had from the house. I think it looks pretty good. Now, I don't know if these olive olive branches going to stay right here because I am getting an olive tree in here. So, I just don't know if it's going to be giving too much. Also, I don't like how this is just sitting on a table. Kind of want it to sit on something. I don't know. And then, we got this little situation. We got a book with this little tray. I got a candle downstairs I want to put right there. These two little things came from Home Goods. They used to be in my living room. And then we just got some a crystal and some books right there. So just, you know, a little something, something. Kind of burnt the sugar on the top a little bit and I kind of already tasted it but it's pretty good proud of myself I really want to get into my bacon bag you want to taste it cost $14 at the restaurant mm -hmm. yeah it's good put a little blueberry with it That's real good. Two down, one more to go. So the one in the middle is the one from Amazon and then this one is the one from Home Depot. They are a little different, but it's cool. Like it ain't it ain't that big of a deal for real. I mean I'm happy to have some vines so, though, because I'm tired of looking at people and I know they tired of seeing me naked. So I'm excited. Let's see. Um, they look about the same to me, y'all. I can't deal with that right now. This is the end of moving vlog number four. Thank you so much for watching. In the next vlog, you'll see more room updates. So I'm so excited to share them with you all. If you are new here, please consider subscribing. If you are not new here, thank you for joining me each and every time I upload. It's truly appreciated. I love you all so much. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.